Well, some disturbing pictures on Facebook have launched a new investigation tonight. They might make you think twice about using a shopping cart or putting your child in one. A woman posted these photos on Facebook yesterday from outside the 99 Ranch Market in San Jose. She claims that meat vendors used carts from a nearby Costco to transport the raw meat into 99 Ranch without wrapping it up or protecting it. People on Facebook were tagging the Santa Clara County Health Department asking them to do an inspection on 99 Ranch's meat handling procedures. Tonight, 99 Ranch and Costco are responding. 99 Ranch apologized, saying they were going to be investigating this case further and filing a complaint against their meat vendor. And Costco says all of the shopping carts at the Northeast San Jose store are now being sanitized. It was just absolutely gross. Slabs of raw, uncovered meat in a shopping cart during what looks like a delivery for a local grocery store. The well, first thing I did was snap a photo. This is the photo Loretta Cito says she took on her cell phone last week when she went grocery shopping at 99 Ranch Market in San Jose. Loretta later posted the picture on social media. These two guys, slabs of pork, I think they were just like cut in half and some were just kind of flopped over so it was on the handle bars. According to Loretta, it happened on January 14th. 99 Ranch Market told NBC Bay Area they found out about it today, nearly two weeks later. The store says the men in the photo are not 99 Ranch Market employees, but rather delivery guys from their meat vendor, Jim's Farm Meat. The store has immediately removed and discarded their inventory of Jim's Farm Meat products, said the company in a statement they sent to us. We are working with our supplier to ensure such an incident will not occur again. It was absolutely horrific in my opinion. Kids can easily get sick, so my first thought was just to protect other moms and kids out there. Loretta Cito's reaction to seeing how raw meat was handled at her local Ranch 99 market in San Jose was immediate and visceral. It's just slabs of pork um, just kind of plopped into the shopping carts and reeling through the front door. My first thought was just, it's just absolutely disgusting. Disgusting and unsanitary. That's why Sito says she snapped these photos and posted them online as a warning to other parents who might unknowingly expose themselves either to the contaminated carts or questionable meat. My first instinct as a mom was to tell other parents in the Facebook mommies group that just beware of these shopping carts. Who knows if they put the carts right back without sanitizing it or without, you know, pressure washing it. The photos went viral, shared and liked and posted on websites like Yelp, where they were eventually noticed by the supermarket chain. Ranch 99 responded online, writing, We are very sorry to know about this incident. Please know that 99 Ranch is committed to food safety. We are investigating this case and have filed a complaint to the meat vendor. Cito says that's encouraging, but also believes some independent outside agency like the health department should investigate as well just reeling it in through the front door. It was just gross. Walking into 99 Ranch Market on Maryland Parkway, we send him running. This guy does a now you see me, now you don't, as he literally runs to the back of the store after seeing our camera. It's not long after that we begin to be surrounded. But you see these guys that are sort of like bookending us with walkie talkies? There's this dude right here and this dude right over there. Then the running man reappears. Are you, can you find the person in charge of the deli for me? I got this for me. You got someone coming? Thank you. We wait at the deli, which is operating with a 30 demerit C grade. Health inspectors found water from thawing raw duck and chicken draining directly onto thawing raw beef. Raw chicken was also stored at room temperature, and a whole raw pig was left unattended on the back prep table at room temperature. There was also excessive water, food buildup, and debris throughout the facility on floors, walls, and beneath equipment. And holy cross-contamination, Batman. Raw duck and chicken were thawing in the same basin as raw pork. The minutes tick by as our escorts keep watch. If I'd have known I'd been standing around and waiting for this long, I'd have worn more comfortable shoes today. Other violations inspectors found were a large bowl of raw chicken stored directly on top of another uncovered bowl of raw chicken. Grocery bags and garbage bags were used to store whole raw pork, cooked dumplings, and egg rolls. And there was a lot of old dried food debris on the can opener, deli slicer, and egg slicer blades. 
finally, the manager appears. Um, we're here because you guys are on Dirty Dining for the 30 demerit C grade that's hanging oh, up right there. And we'd like to get your side of the story. Uh, no comment. We have no comment. You have no comment. You know, there was cross contamination of raw meat. There was food stored in garbage bags, excessively dirty conditions. I can direct you guys to our legal department, and that's all I can say. Does the legal, does the lawyers know what the kitchen staff does? Uh, as far as any questions, anything, I just direct you guys to the legal department. Yeah. Would the legal department know about the cutting boards that were no longer cleanable, the excessively dirty wiping cloths, and the wooden planks used as shelving in the cooler? All right, we always like to give everyone the chance to give their side of the story because your customers would rather hear from you than having me call yeah. some corporate number. Understood. You get that? Yeah. But I still have to call the lawyers. Legal department, yes. Uh -huh. yeah. I called the legal department at the supermarket's parent company in Southern California. A spokesperson said they're aware of the C grade and are working with staff and the health district to clean things up and correct all violations. 99 Ranch Market's Deli still has a C grade.